hey guys welcome back to my channel so i posted a picture on my instagram asking you guys to ask me questions so i can answer your questions while i do my makeup so that's what i'm gonna be doing today today i'm going to do a simple as makeup look okay so for my brows i'm going to be using the uh, powders from the morphe powder one question that i got a lot was why did you cut your hair so some of you guys know my best friend passed away 10 months ago due to cancer so one day at school during lunch, a St. Baldrick's organization came and they were cutting people's hair to donate it. And I remember I was walking by at lunch with my friends and I saw that and it made me think so much of her. And I wanted to do it. I just, I just had this urge to go and do it. I told my friends I was going to go. And next thing you know, I, I was walking over there and I sat down and then my hair was in my hands. I was just thinking about her the whole time. I wanted to give back because I was thinking there might have been someone who was going through or is going through what she went through and I wanted to help by doing that and it just reminded me a lot of her and I wanted to do it for me it was kind of like honoring her and her memory For my eyebrows, I'm just going to fill them in lightly. Another question I got related to that was, um, although you cut your hair to donate it, do you like having short hair? Um, yes, I do. At first, I was a bit like insecure about it because everyone's so used to seeing girls with long hair and when you see a girl with short hair, it's just like people stare you down. It's just like not like seen a lot. So um, at first, I was really insecure about it, but I remember why I did it, so I, so I don't care what anyone else thinks, and yeah, I mean it's hair, hair grows back, so. Next I'm taking the LA Girl Concealer and I'm gonna use that to clean up my eyebrows. Another question I got asked is, what age did you first start getting into makeup? And by that I mean when you started doing full face makeup. Okay, at what age? I don't remember what age, but I I was in eighth grade, 13, 14. I remember in eighth grade I would just do um my eyebrows, mascara, I think some powder. And sometimes lipstick. That that was when I first started. Um. Oh my God! No. Also some eyeliner. If you really want your eyeshadow to show, then. Don't I remember because my mom didn't allow me to wear makeup so I remember <laughs> I would go to school early and do my makeup before like class started and then like right when I got out of school because she would pick me up 
I would run to the restroom and like quitármelo todo and then I would do that every day. So I would basically only have it on like for school. Um, so my mom never taught me. She would like chingarme. Obviously, I wanted to get better at it, but it was so hard to like practice. Si no te dejaban en tu house. But I think una vez she did catch me. Yeah, after that she was like, okay, like fine. And she let me. And after my mom, like, me dio permiso to do my makeup. Freshman year, I wouldn't call it a full face because, I mean, I did everything except lashes. I didn't know how to put on lashes. I couldn't, like, siempre me las ponía, like, todas chuecas. He, like, it was always so bad. And I remember que siempre le decía a mi friend Maria or Kathy, like, if they can come to the restroom para que me las pusieran. I know they remember. Uh, it was, like, so funny now that I think about it because I would, like, text them and be like, oh, can you come to the restroom? And then I will pop out with my little lashes, give me lash glue, and then I will be like, oh, can you put these on for me? they the real MVPs. So I'll say... Mm, junior year, I'll say junior year, is when I started going all out, like full face and shit. That was like, what, two years ago? A year or two ago? Yeah. Another question was, how did you get better at doing your makeup? How long did it take you to learn how to do it? Was it frustrating? How are you feeling about it? Um, I say I've been practicing for three to four years already. It takes practice and it takes time. I'm still not the best, but I'm still learning. It is really frustrating, but just keep practicing and soon enough you'll get the hang of it. It takes practice, trust me. <laughs> What's your favorite color? Yellow is my favorite color. I'm gonna bring the concealer down to my lid. How did you start getting into makeup? Okay, so, growing up, I would always see my mom doing her makeup um, and my sister. Um, I was raised by two women, so that kind of influenced everything i would just always see them doing their makeup like casi todos los días me despertaba and my sister would be next to me like because she would wake up hella early to do her makeup and she would be next to me y yo me despertaba y ella ya andaba doing her makeup because when i was in middle school she went to high school already so she already had permission to do her makeup like desde chiquilla my mom told me that i would like grab her lipsticks and like put them on my eyes, on my cheeks, on my lips. Like I use that for my full face and shit. I would just say a big part that influenced me were the ladies that raised me. Do you like making videos with me? Do you like me as your cousin? Do you like babysitting me? Yes, yes, yes. I love you. So next, I'm gonna do my foundation. Porque me miro bien roja. And I'm gonna use my e.l.f. primer. I really like this primer porque me deja my skin really glowy. And I have dry skin, so that's good. What was your first lipstick? If I had to take a guess, because I'm not sure, I would say it was my Jeffree Star lipstick. Um... I still have it. It's like my treasure. Like, 
I don't, I'm never throwing it away. Like, it's empty already, but I don't want to throw it away. Um, because every other lipstick I used before that, like I said, it was like my mom's or my sister's. Yeah, my Jeffree Star lipstick. I remember after that, I would just always be buying Jeffree Star lipsticks. But now, I don't because I'm like, um, they really are expensive. But, antes, I don't know, I guess no me importaba. Today, I'm gonna be using my LA Girl Foundation. What is the one thing you love doing the most? Makeup, duh. Okay, but besides that, like, I really love laughing, like... If you know me, you know that I'm always laughing, like, me rio por todo. I love it. If you can make me laugh, well, I'm pretty sure anyone can make me laugh because I laugh at every little thing. But if you can make me laugh, like, that's the point for you. I already love you. <laughs> How long does it take you to do your makeup? Well, that depends. The longest I've taken is, like, two hours. Two hours max, I think. I'm pretty sure two hours max. But if it's like supposed to be like natural or whatever, maybe 30 minutes. What is your goal in life? Um, I would say my goal in life is to be successful. Like, no matter what I do end up doing, I hope that I succeed in it. Um, I have a lot of, like, goals for my future that I want to achieve. If I had to say one thing, I would say, like, happiness. Haga lo que haga, I want to be happy. Who knows if I'll end up doing something totally unrelated to makeup or, like, beauty. But whatever it is, I just want to be happy. Happy about what I'm doing. I want to love what I do. Why are you so beautiful? Oh, thank you. <laughs> my gosh, look at my under eyes. <laughs> what inspired you to do a YouTube channel? By the way, you're gorgeous. Oh, thank you. And me. I inspired me to do this channel. I actually started. I think it was junior year. I had a couple of videos. I did like two or three videos. I uploaded them. I don't know why. I just stopped. And then I ended up deleting them. Which lash brand is your fave? I would say um, J Lash because they're really affordable and they have the prettiest lashes. I think their lashes are like seven or eight bucks. And they have pretty bomb lashes. Who's your favorite makeup girl? Ooh, I've actually never really thought of that. I don't even think I have a favorite. I mean, I watch a lot of YouTubers. Um, but recently, I've been watching Alan Knight a lot. I love his videos. He's really funny. I guess he's my favorite right now. Next, I'm gonna take my RCMA powder. And I put that all over my face to set it. Be careful with this powder because it gets everywhere. What are your goals to reach pursuing makeup? Hopefully in the future, you know, have my own business to get big one day. And that's truly a goal for me because I remember me and my best friend would talk about it. I would just talk to her about how I really love makeup. And I feel like she really believed in me and she would always tell me like, yes, like you go get it. You were going to be big one day and I'll never forget her telling me that because I know she believed in me. So it, it's truly a goal for me. Hopefully one day that'll come true. What's your favorite makeup brand? Honestly, I wouldn't know what to answer for that because I like so many 
styles from like so many brands. <laughs> I look crazy as fuck when pinchy powder and minari. If you got to choose one makeup product for the rest of your of your life, what would it be? It would be foundation because I'm red as fuck. I don't want to go like the rest of my life with that foundation. Okay, next I'm gonna contour. It's so funny to like think back because I also remember in middle school I filmed videos like on my iPod and I would make YouTube videos and just recently I was like looking through my files and I found those videos and I was like oh my god like I'm gonna insert a clip so you guys can see I mean, that was like years ago, so this is something I've been wanting to do, and now I'm doing it. We're gonna highlight. Shit. Imagine going on like this. By the way, I wasn't kidding when I said I still have my first lipstick. It's right here. Okay, so I'm gonna use the Vivid Matte Liquid Lipstick and Nude Flush. And this is from Maybelline. Okay guys, so this was it. This video subscribe and like this video and comment <laughs>